<laughs> Morning, everybody. Um, okay, so um, yeah, today uh, it's uh, four or five days after I had my uh, car accident, and I'm currently house housebound. I was like, I've been like bedridden. Haven't really been able to get out of bed um, because you know car accident, and I don't have a car, and I'm stuck at my house, which is a long way away from civilization. Uh, that means that you and I, me and you, right now, are gonna hang out and do some things. I've got a few video ideas that I'm gonna smash out today, but first I'm gonna put a t-shirt on because, because I'm, feeling I'm feeling ultra fat. Ultra fat. <laughs> I complain about feeling ultra fat, and then I put on a t-shirt about when I played national sport, and now I'm just a fat shit who makes YouTube videos. Sick, okay, love that for us. <laughs> Look, okay. I bought this new Gorilla Pod the other day, but it's like a small one for my phone because I'm a lonely boy who likes taking Instagram photos. So I went and bought this one for my phone, and then I was like, yeah, let's just chuck the camera on it. And I put it on and it just went, that's cool. Basically, what today is going to consist of is, uh, me. That's it. <laughs> no, okay, so how do I go about doing this? Do I tell the truth? Recently, I saw a meme on Instagram, like a photo on Instagram. And it was something about male, like, stigma and, like, guys not using skincare. And if they do, then they're, like, gay. I saw that and I was like, uh, no, no, no. I don't like feeling crusty. And I see, I actually said this in a cool Q&A video. I reached out to a few brands. <laughs> yeah, I did. And I was like, hey, I want to make this video about, like, skincare. I got zero responses. <laughs> Zero. Luckily enough, when I was away at VidCon, I spent way too much money on skincare products, but I just wanted to see if I could get any brands involved because a bit of a piss take. So anyways, today I'm going to be doing skincare and I'm absolutely clueless on how all of it works. I also went and bought a new razor because Dollar Shave Club also didn't respond to me, so I'm cool. I've got cool shaving cream, refresh foaming cleanser, Hydra Power moisturizing cream with birch sap for all skin types, a lip scrub, a minimal rich magnetic mud mask. On top of this I also have lots of alcohol. But yes. Underwear. Underwear. Let's go and use all this stuff on my face and see if I can get rid of this acne. <laughs> because we love acne. acne. I didn't really think about the logistics of filming this. Shit. Oh, chic. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna. We're just, oh. Cool. Look, this is going so well. That that little two seconds right there is basically how the rest of this video is gonna go. So if you want to stick around to see how all of this unfolds, good on you. Because I wouldn't. That's just me. Fuck. What am I doing with my life? Look, this is all from different brands as well. So you know what? This was a brand deal. This video will be a lot more cohesive, but it's not because everyone hates me. We do know what brands we're using. This is from Frang. You guys can even see that. All of this stuff was the stuff I spent way too much money on from Botanifique. This is from Secret, uh, like Secret with like C, like Ocean. Secret, lol. Nice play on words. This razor I bought from Coles. Schick or Schick, Schick, Schick. Is it Schick or Schick? Shkick. And then these two are also for Tanifik. Look, I spent way too much money on these three things. I got these given to me. And it was, this wasn't even going to be part of the video, but then I saw it yesterday when I was thinking about shooting this video. And I was like, yeah, let's just throw that in the mix. And I didn't want to use a two cents Bic razor. So I went and bought this. Spent like $16 on this thing, so I better be good. Yeah, so anyways, let's get um straight on into this video. Step one, we need to shave. Think about this, right? This video is just gonna follow no structure, nothing at all, because I don't know why, I just don't feel like structuring this at all. The acoustics in this room are phenomenal. Oh shit, okay, bye. What we're gonna do, so this is why I need my little grillery potty thing. What if we sit the camera up here? Don't think this is safe. If you guys could see how this was sitting right now, you would hate me. Where's my phone? I don't want to leave because it's going to fall. It's not my camera. Okay, wait there. Wait there. Just look at how my camera is sitting right now. Like, it is balancing in the little crevice. <laughs> I'm just going to roll with it. I'm just going to make sure I don't move the mirror. I almost need to, like, gaffer tape it. So the thing about this shaving cream, right? So this... Herbal Glide Shaving Cream for all oh, skin. Oh my god, there is this noise in the roof of my house and it's driving me insane. 
It smells so good. It smells like every man ever. In a good way, but like not like in a BO kind of stinky way, but like, um, yes, it smells like a dude in a good way, which is not something that we usually smell like over here in this cute little life. So whenever I use this shaving cream, it's really good. It also doesn't foam up like the rest of them do. And when I was sold this stuff, apparently that's a good thing because the foam is like bad. That I could, I could be making that up, I don't know. But we're just gonna go with it because that sounded like it was the right thing to say. Okay, let's try this um this thing. Ooh. Ooh, this feels good. Ooh, there's like so much suspension in this thing. Like I'll push it down on my face and it'll like bounce around. Ooh, yeah, get that, get that, get it. Ooh, yeah. I'm also just recovering from a big shaving mark, just like, can you guys see it? This mark here, you might be thinking, What is that pimple? It is a shaving cup from when I used one of those 50 cent things that has no suspension in it whatsoever. So I'm over here just trying to shave my face, but for some reason I had like an event. I don't shave my face unless I've got a reason. Like, do you get that vibe? Like, I'm just not about that everyday shave look. Like, I don't, I don't mind looking homeless every now and again. What's, okay. So if there's any dudes watching this who shave, probably not, because my target audience is like three-year-old females. No offense to anyone who's not a three-year-old female that watches my videos. Why? I actually did just check my YouTube analytics because I said that as a joke, but like... My audience thing is like females. Huh? 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 What? I think YouTube's broken, because I, I was joking, but... Ah. If there are any dudes who like regularly shave watching this video, how do you go about getting the hair. Yeah, this is a prime example of dudes that can't multitask. Usually I say that I'm pretty good at multitasking, but I just can't. I cannot focus on shaving my face and, <laughs> and talking at the same time. What was I even saying? Oh yeah, how do you go about getting the hair off the bloody, this, this thing in here? Like, do you like hit it against the side of the sink? like? with hot water or cold water. Look, it's been a real like period of trial and error since I've started, because only recently has my facial hair been growing at like an alarming rate. Like it seems to have like tripled in its like metab metabolic growing rate. That is definitely not a proper term that's um, supposed to be used. Proper term that's um, supposed to be used. But I used to have to shave like, I don't know, once every few weeks. And now if I like, have events on, I'll be shaving like once every few days. No way, that's a cut. Uh-uh. I, I refuse to believe that. Double chin tone. I find that this is the best way to shave your like underneath bits, is like double chin it up. It is, look. That is a cut. I spent $16 on this razor so it wouldn't fucking cut me in this video because that is embarrassing. And guess what I did? It fucking cut me. Shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It didn't even fall. And I just had a heart attack. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, look, this is how this is gonna work. We're gonna turn these lights off because that's just not good lighting. That's good lighting. Look at that. Ooh, ooh, bougie. Get that blue eyes over here, mother Okay, ready? Okay, that transition was probably atrociously bad, but I'm just gonna use it anyways because it'll be quite funny. We finished shaving. I only cut myself once, which was super cute. That's all we need to do in the bathroom. I'm using shaving cream that is not like Gillette Fusion. Wait, I think I might even have something here. Yeah, this stuff. Oh my god, it's chic! It's Kick Hydro. Using um, shaving cream that's not this has actually really helped my skin feel a lot better like after shaving because especially now, as I said before, I'm shaving more often because I'm a big boy now. I feel my skin is not drying out after shaving and I don't actually have to moisturize even though I do because I spend all of this money on moisturizers and stuff. But anyways, moving on. Um, what are we gonna do next? Yeah. Okay, the lighting here is super bougie, so um, oh yes, I love this shot. This shot is so much fun. Oh, this is a fun tripod. Yes, let's go for creativity. Look at this. This big game of home brand, no, that's not even the side that the neighbors on. Home brand Jenga that's called the Giant Tumbling Tower. Oh, yes. Look at us go. I was just gonna have to deal with this shadow, and now that I've told you that it's there, you're gonna get really annoyed and probably leave the video, but look, if you do, then you're obviously just not a loyal fan. <laughs> I don't know why I'm putting so much effort into the brands that I'm using in this video and the actual products, because no one actually wanted me to do this except for me. I am literally only making this video because I'm on house arrest. I don't have a car to get anywhere, and I live in the middle of butt nowhere. But look, if you guys are enjoying this, I'll be- I'll brush my car on more often. No, I will not do that. Oh no, I spilt some of my mud mask on the carpet. Do I care? No. Once you take your little tub of black, what looks like black 
goo, black poo. <laughs> I'm funny. Put it on your face. I, there's no actual instructions with this. Ah, I keep dropping it. This shit's expensive. I can't just go dropping it everywhere, Jacob. Oh my god, this wind is crazy. Who, in my ancestral tree, family tree of ancestors, decided to live on an island where the weather is more bipolar than me? Thinking forward, when was that a good idea? I just don't know. You're supposed to like spread it out. This is where I got to last time. And I did that, I did this much. And I was like, yes, I feel good. All I've got to do is spread it out. And once I started, trying to get like this into like an even layer was basically like trying to save the Notre Dame from burning. <laughs> it's just something that seems possible. But it's just not possible. Like, you spread it, but there's just not enough. How am I supposed to portionize this tiny little tub to 24? I almost felt like, with the amount of money I paid for this thing, it's not gonna not get 24 months out of it, because then that would be stupid. Because if I'm meant to get 24 months out of it, I will get 24 months, or 24 uses, I should say. Okay, look, I'm just gonna use a little bit more, because I just feel like this is the one time where I should allow myself to. I'm doing it for a cause. Dying starvation of my YouTube, YouTube success. success. Hey, look, here's a thumbnail. The next phase in what you're supposed to do with these things is like wait. So I'm just gonna sit here and wait a little bit. This is what's happening so far. This is my mask. This clueless Australian is trying a mud mask and it's 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 just not something that works whenever he tries it. We love this, we love this. Okay, magnetic mud flaps. Yes, that's what we want. Oh my God, why are there ones on here that are just so cheap in comparison to what I paid? Look, that is just not okay. Okay, look, I'm gonna watch a one minute and 22 video tutorial on how these are supposed to work. <sighs> a one minute and 22 video tutorial. It's the secret one! This video is by secret! That's this is the secret mineral rich magnetic mud mask uses the power of biomagnetism. These guys better sponsor me. Oh, I'm more attractive than this guy. Hers spreads on so much easier than mine. How does hers just get that evenly spread? I did the exact same thing as her. I did the exact same process. I used the little spool, spooloojibijibi thing, and I spread it evenly. Nothing worked. It just didn't happen for me today. I, don't even, I can't even think of the right words to use right now. This whole beauty guru skincare stuff. It just, it's like a whole nother language. Like, if there are any guys watching this, which as I said, I don't know why. Uh, where was I going with that? Why, where was I going with that? Oh yeah, it's like a whole nother language. Like I just don't understand how all this works. I feel like I need to put a hat on. I'm gonna get a hat. This part is actually quite easy, but that's also because apparently we don't have enough. Oh, it feels so satisfying. It just like pops off your face. Oh, it's so satisfying to watch. I wish the ugliness could be magnetically pulled off my face. I'm not even touching my face with this thing. Like, it's just not even being touched. touched. This will be like a magical transition, like it was with my shaving, except it's real. This is no camera tricks whatsoever. Bang, look. And it's just gone. It's just gone. Like, voila, boom, boom, shake the room. Okay, this is like my favorite thing to do. Maybe I will just become a beauty guru. I would love to just sit here and try different face masks. I reckon that would be so much fun. And my face feels so... Like, good. Oh my god, I'm glowing. Look at this. Oh my god! Anyways, so that's the magnetic mate fate make me yeah, 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 that. Um, that's, that's the magnetic ma mace. Fuck! That's the magnetic face mask. I would happily just run away like this, okay? Like, I feel like my face feels really good and like moisturized right now. And like, I can just rub my face and then I can rub my hands and then my hands feel good. Like, I'd happily go out and hold my own hand in public because, you know, I'm a lonely motherfucker and no one likes me. But, um, how much do we use? I'm gonna do four squirts and then. What does this do for my skin? That's what I. Oh, it hurts. It's stinging. Like, who comes up with this stuff and goes, yes, this is a very good product for people to use on their skin. Rinse thoroughly with a generous amount of warm water. It smells good. This product smells really good. Okay. It has been washed off. God, I've been recording for such a long time. Um, okay, so that leaves two products. We have the actual moisturizer. Now, this is a product that I actually do use because whenever I'm lying in bed and I'm like, you know, feeling my face because I don't know, why not? And I'm like, ah, oh, I feel crusty and gross. Um, I will go and just put a tiny little bit of this on and um, it does make me feel a lot better about myself and my self esteem like skyrockets while I'm laying in bed by myself. Um, but if you're like me and you don't enjoy 
the feeling crust if it's not on your pizza, haha, you're in for a treat if you buy some proper moisturizer. Not that I'm giving you any discount codes or product sponsors, because no one likes me, and I just wanted to make this video. How many times am I gonna say that in this video? Oh my god, I'm not putting a counter on, I'm too lazy, but if you wanna count how many times I've talked about not having sponsorships for this video, tell me. Tell me down in the comment section. But that wasn't a very convenient way to do it, because now how do I... <laughs> that was not very smart. Now it's in my hair. Oh my god, it is everywhere. Under my neck as well. So once, you have um, good, clo good globs? Good globs of moisturizer everywhere around your face. You just have to rub that shit in. Oh, it's burning. It's burning. That's because I have so many cuts on my face from being a hopeless shaver. Get the ears involved. Yes, good hearing. See, I heard if you moisturize your ears, it cleanses your hearing. I didn't actually hear that, but that sounded good, so let's just go with it. Wow, okay. And that's, that's done. Now, the only thing left to do, get this Frank Body Coffee Scrub. That's, I just don't understand how much is like a good amount of this stuff to use at all, like in any kind of product. Oh no, see, it just fell off. Oh, up on the box it would have told me if it was edible or not. But when I taste it, it literally just tastes like coffee and just a lot of undissolved sugar. <laughs> Maybe that's what it is. If anyone knows what's in the Frank Lip Scrub that's like coffee flavored, apparently I just have to wipe it off. So um, it's, it actually says scrub it off, but I'm not gonna go and like throw water in my face because my face is very well moisturized. <gasps> okay, so um, look, my, f my skin feels flawless right now. Like, oh, ooh, ooh, at all, it looks disgusting. That's a big pimple I have right here. I just got told that movie recording has been stopped automatically and lucky it was happening right now. My skin, I feel, I feel, it feels good. That's all that matters. You can't expect a mud mask to just rip the red pimples off your face. I mean, you can expect it, but you're just gonna get heartbroken, disappointed and angry. But hey, maybe that's the <laughs> secret. <laughs> I'm gonna pack up all this stuff and I'm gonna go and edit this video and go back to bed because my neck hurts. If you guys did enjoy this Clueless Aussie does skincare video, make sure to give it a big, make sure to be, uh, make sense? Cool. Okay, bye. I'm kidding. Okay, so if you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to leave it a big thumbs up. If you want more Clueless, like me being the Clueless Aussie because um, it sounds good in a title, um, if you want more of these videos, um, leave a comment down below, tell me what else you want me to do. Um, I'm okay, by the way. If anyone was actually wondering, my neck is very sore still. Um, my car, it's currently Monday, and the crash happened on last Friday. So the old insurance stuff's getting dealt with today. I'm okay. I'm alive, and that's all that matters. So thank you guys all for all your support and messages and love over the weekend, because, um, yeah, it was really kind of refreshing and nice to get some cool messages. But yeah, I'm okay. I'm alive. Thank you. Okay. Peace. My skin feels phenomenal, like it's so good. Okay, yeah, bye. <laughs>